What's going on, YouTube? This is your neighborhood DraftKings addict bringing you my top picks for this Wednesday's main DraftKings MLB slate, guys. All right, so on the screen, guys, you're going to see Draft Dashboard. Again, this is my tool of choice for uh, MLB research just because, again, it puts a lot of information right on the screen for you to make decisions when it comes to uh, MLB DFS, guys. So check out the link in the description. There is a seven-day trial for one buck if you use the uh, link in my description, guys. Also, as a benefit, guys, any players that I watch, you guys will be able to access as well if you use the description, uh, the link in the description, guys. All right, so you see right here, if you go into your uh, watch player list and you click on watch DK Addicts picks, it will import any uh, players that I have in my player pool, guys. So, all right, so let's go ahead and let's get with uh, get on with uh, today's top picks, guys. So what I generally like to do is I like to go to the top players today and just uh, select my slate and normally I go, uh, go with my batters and I just sort it by uh, the uh, draft rank. All right, cool, cool. So I love it. So makes it real easy for me, guys. All right, so check it out. Draft dashboard, $1, seven-day trial, guys. All right, so let's just get right to it, guys. So on the screen, you see some of my, my top plays. All right, so in here we have uh, John Gray, guys. I like John Gray. He has uh, one of the best matchups, guys, playing in San Diego, a um, a pitcher's park. All right, guys, and uh, against a team that strikes out a lot, so it's a match made in heaven. He's only 8.5k, guys. So I like him in this situation. To be honest, the pitcher, the pitcher's on the main slate. There's nobody that really, really stands out, but I like John Gray just because of again his uh, his uh, position at uh, in the ballpark. Okay, all right. At second base, I like Jed Lowry, guys. This guy's only 3.3k, guys. All right, I believe he's hitting um, high up in the order. Yes, he's hitting number two. All right, in the game that's projected to have five runs with the wind blowing out in Oakland. All right, so I like Jed Lowry in that position. All right. And plus, it's kind of like a little mini stack, to be honest, all right? So, Jed Lowry, all right? Because the other guy, like, as you can see, he's batting right after him. That's going to be Matt Olsen at first base, guys. All right? I like this guy here. He has power. You know, he can hit it out the park. I like Matt Olsen in this, in this, in this position, guys. As you can see, he has 8 and 11 in the last couple of games. Um, four at-bats. He got a couple of hits, all right? So, I like Matt Olson's chance, again, in the game that's projected to score five runs. I like the little mini stack of Matt Olson and Jed Lowry in Oakland, guys. All right. And number three, guys, come on now. Nolan Arenado, guys. The guy's 5K for a reason. You know, he, he's going to smash in this position, guys. So if you go to Arenado, you see he's batting third, but he's going against the lefty, guys. All right. They're only projected to, to make 3.7 runs, but Arenado can bust that wide open, guys. So. I like Nolan Arenado, guys. I feel like he's a must play, especially in cash, because, again, he's known to be a killer. All right. So next up is another value play. I like Grandison in this game. Toronto has the highest um, projected runs on the board when it comes to Vegas. All right. So if we go here, 5.3 projected runs, guys. All right. No, Don't have to worry about weather. The roof is closed. All right. Grandison, if you look at him right here, guys, he's batting in fifth, guys. So I like him to clean up some of these uh, and get some hits and uh, some RBIs, guys. All right. I also like Solarte, guys, just as a side note, but I didn't put him in my top plays at the moment. But I do like Solarte, guys. So there you go, man. That's my top five plays for today. All right, guys, if you don't want to play up for Arenado, all right, you got a couple other options, right? At third base, you can go to position optimizer here on draft dashboard, select your slate, go to third base. Sort by draft, uh, draft, uh, dash rank. All right, you got Arenado, you got Donaldson, you got Shaw, Headley, and Davidson all right here sitting at the top. All right, they have the best matchup and are in the best positions when it comes to scoring points. All right, but uh, good luck to that, guys. Again, remember MLB is a marathon, not a sprint, guys. Slow and steady, guys. All right, so these are my top five plays at the moment. Like the video if you enjoy it. Also, guys, if you could. Uh, drop me a comment. Let me know what plays you're on. If you have any plays that you like, all right. Or if you think any plays that I pick, uh, I'm running into a brick wall on guys. Maybe you know I missed something in my research process. But uh, share your comments down below, guys. Thank thanks to everyone for the follows. All of my uh, subscribers, I really do appreciate you guys. A lot of people came over from the NBA, and I got a couple of people that have uh, subscribed recently uh, with the start of MLB. But uh, uh, thank you guys again for the love, and uh, I'll see you guys on the next video.